Hey, beautiful, I see you. Here I am on behalf of Contemporary Living with Farmer and Hill, your Wednesday night. Wanted to share some thoughts with you, so I wrote them down. So this is what I call Ain't It Funny. Ain't it funny how people can muster up all the passion and energy in the world to argue, but not have enough kindness in their hearts to say, I love you, or thank you, or good morning or tell people what they actually mean to them. Ain't it funny how people can know what the answer to your problem is, but won't share it with you? Ain't it funny how we laugh at other people's pain, downfall, and tragedies, and feel absolutely nothing until it happens to us? Ain't it funny how the lives of athletes and entertainers become a part of our own, but we will avoid at all costs having a conversation with our neighbors? Ain't it funny how there can be a room full of people totally disengaged from one another because of a phone? I was just thinking about those things. See, when you look at those things individually, they don't seem to matter much. But I think we really should start becoming aware and conscious of what you know we're we're how we're spending our time and how we're treating others really because time is a thief and once it's gone you can't take it back those seconds become minutes those minutes become hours those hours become days those days become weeks those weeks become months and those months become years and then before you know it the season changes and you're wondering, where did all the time go? See, the average life expectancy, the average age life expectancy is 78.7 years. Yep. And so if you're 40 years old right now today, you are on the other side of the halfway mark. So you can't afford to keep making the same mistakes with people, with relationships, with your health, with your walk with God, with your career, with your finances. If you're 40 or above, you cannot afford to keep <laughs> making those mistakes. It's time for you to hit the ground running. And I think the, the fortunate part is that every day we get to live, it provides that, us that opportunity. Because as long as you're on this side of eternity, you still have life. There's still something for you to do. So right now, this is what I want you to do. Take out a sheet of paper or don't, don't even do that. Picture in your mind's eye. What should your life be looking like right now? Picture in your mind's eye what your life should be looking like right now. Then write all the things down that it takes to create that life. Write down what it takes to accomplish that. And then you got to go all in. You got to go for it, whatever it is. See, there are dreamers, there are people who talk about their dreams and then there are people that actually live their dreams. So you got to decide which one you are. It's up to you. I started off talking about ain't it funny, but time is of the essence, especially if you're 40 or above. All right. And don't forget Tomorrow, if you are here in Richmond Park, you have the opportunity to talk about women and money at the Richmond Park Library from 6 to 7.30 p.m. That's Thursday, December 6th, 6 to 7.30 p.m. Richmond Park Library. You don't have to have read the book in order to be a part of the discussion because it's going to be a good one and you can get involved because you've lived life. You've made money. So... Come on in. Come on, join us. All right. 
Andre and I thank you. And as always, be brilliant. Be you. Be blessed. Bye-bye.